Hey everyone and welcome to this video. So today we're going to take a look at DVAC. It's a company backed by Donald Trump. And right now it's still pre-merger, but when the merger is done, it's going to be called Truth Social. So here you can see on the 30 minute chart that we are currently in an uptrend and we're about to break or we have already broken the resistance line uh, from before. And as you can see here, we have been trading below $40 for a little bit. And this is due to the SEC investigations going on between the SPAC and TMTG, Donald Trump's uh, company, if there's any miscommunications between these two companies. But I actually don't think there's anything here to worry about. It is just drama between the Democrats and the Republicans. So I wouldn't look too much into this SEC investigation. Plus a lot of SPAC deals uh, usually goes under <clears throat> some kind of investigation. We saw that on Lucid as well and I, and I don't think this should, should worry anyone actually and that's so far there's no evidence that there's been any wrongdoing between Trump's company and the spec DVAC so yeah other than that you're also seeing that Devin Nunes is resigning from Congress to join as the CEO of this new true social company and he's a pretty strong leader to have as a CEO. I think this is very positive news and we also saw that the stock gained uh, over 15% when this was announced. So uh, this is really great news, I think. Donald Trump is, is putting together a strong team to at this company. And if we take a look at the projected revenue for True Social, we can see here that by 2026, they are estimating a $3.66 billion revenue with 81 million users using the platform and an RPU, also called average revenue per user, is going to be around $13.50. So this really seems like valid number it's not over realistic I think it's very realistic these numbers and as you can see here they're only estimating around 16 million users in 2022 I think these numbers should be way way higher Um, also the revenue 1 million I think they'll surprise in a lot of uh, upcoming earnings reports when when true social opens up to the public and I'm pretty sure they're going to do that in the first quarter of 2022 and as you can see here right before Donald Trump was banned from Twitter Facebook Instagram he had 146 million followers on all platforms together i know some of these might be the same you know you can follow him on facebook twitter and instagram at least i think he has almost 90 million real people following him and even if 20 percent of these 90 million is going to sign up to true social in the first month or two that's a lot of users that's uh, almost 20 million users in a couple of months so i think this company could explode but but it is still risky and it's trading at a very high stock price right now compared to before the deal between dvac and true social was announced we traded we traded at 10 went all the way up to a high of $175 a share and right now we're trading at $60 a share so this could definitely go above $100 again but right now it is still a risky play and I will play this uh, very carefully but I could I could see this uh, go up and test this resistance line at around $75 a share so that's a pretty good gain of about 20 to 25 percent to the upside and if you take a look at the short interest on dvac you can see that it has almost a 13 percent short interest that's quite a lot for such a new company as you can see here it has been going steadily up so this is very interesting it could definitely squeeze a little bit not an actual short squeeze but i think we could see a squeeze up to around um, maybe a new all-time high and if you go in here on eyebrow we can see that the fees are pretty high sitting at over 30 percent fee just to short the stock and right now there's only 400 shares available to short and as you can see here there's actually not been that many shares available to short so this is very interesting and if you would like to see more of this kind of content then please make sure to subscribe to my channel it means a lot to me and also remember to like the video for the youtube algorithm see you guys next time bye